sorry for the delay. Okay. Uh, right. Let's just start from the beginning, shall we? Yeah. Well, you uh, you know everything I already know. I was working when two uh, men I didn't recognize came into the warehouse. They opened fire. I fired back. One's dead, and the other one ran away. Do you have any idea who might have sent the gunman? No. Has anyone threatened to kill you? Ever? Recently. Say, when it could have been overheard by witnesses, like outside the Metro Court ballroom, for instance. Okay. Not another word. I'm sorry, Commissioner. I tried to stop him. It's fine. I can handle it, don't worry. Um, you were fast. My client called on the way here, and I happened to be in the area, so I would like a word with him alone. Sure. That's fine. I'll check with forensics and see if the cops on the scene have turned up anything. Thank you. Who tried to kill you? It's two shooters. One's dead and one ran away, but you need to get to Sonny and warn him the cops are going to come to question him. I don't need your permission to tell me what's best for my daughter. Oh, Sonny, come on, wait. I know how much you love Christina and how much you care about that baby. But if you pressure Blaze to intervene with Christina, you are only going to push Christina further away. You have to let Christina reach out to you first. What if she doesn't? It might take longer than you would want, but you have to let Christina come to terms with this on her own, and she will definitely contact you. Despite what she saw you do, Christina loves you fiercely, and that just doesn't go away. But if you try to manipulate Blaze into talking to Christina, Christina is going to find out, and she's going to see it as you going behind her back, and that's just going to make everything worse. I know what's best for my daughter. Brick, can this wait? How many shots were fired? Cops there? All right, thanks for letting me know. I'll handle it. Warning him? You're his lawyer, Diane. It's your job. I'm also your lawyer. And right now, I am much more worried about keeping you alive than I am about warning the man who just tried to have you killed. You should answer it. Go ahead. It's Diane. Brooke just told me this trouble at the, the coffee warehouse. Um, yeah, I need you to meet me there. I'm sorry, I'm with another client at the moment. Hang on. Is that Sonny? He wants me to meet him at the coffee Okay, warehouse. go. I'm going to be fine. You just shot and killed a man. Now, you claim it was self-defense, but there's no guarantee the police are going to believe you. In fact, it's more likely that they won't. Anna is going to release me or she's not. Either way, I'm going to be fine. Sonny might not be. He could say something incriminating if you're not there to protect him. Oh. I'll just assume you know what you're doing. I'm on my way. All right, see you there. Diane. Thank you. I want you to think about something. While you are in here worrying about Sonny, how do you know he's not planning another hit on you? 